بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم وقل جاء الحق وزحك الباتل إن الباتل كان زحوقا Truth has come and batil has vanished. Surely, batil is ever bound to vanish. It was God's will. The creation of the universe should begin with Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. will end with his successor, Imam al hujjah Before creating this universe, Allah created the nur of Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. And chosen Imam al Mahdi for its ending. It means the whole universe is always under the blessings of Rahmatul Lil Alameen. It was the night of 15 Shaban when Imam al Mahdi was born. God gave his blessings to the city of Samarra in Iraq. His father was Imam Hassan al Askari, who was our 11th Imam. Our Imam belongs to the bloodline of Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. His mother, Bibi Najasi Khatun, was the princess of Rome. And even today, Rome is a historical place and the capital city of Italy. Many people question why there is such a delay in the reappearance of Imam al Mahdi. Imam is a proof of Allah over his creatures. We will get these answers if you study the Quran. Prophet Isa was born without father, an infant who proved the innocence of Hazrat Yusuf. Prophet Musa was raised in the house of Pharaoh, who was the enemy of Allah, keeping Prophet Yunus alive in the belly of a fish, gave eternal life to Hazrat Khizr till the day of judgment. This means Imam serves as Allah's proof against those who cannot complain on the day of judgment, that there was no one to guide them. Whenever we hear the name of Rasulullah or any other Masulmin, we should ask Allah to send His blessings on them by reciting a salat. But when we mention the name of the time of our Imam, we must show him even more special respect by bowing our heads a little and say, Allahumma ajil farajahu. Imam al huja is hidden from our eyes. Then how can we show our loyalty for him? Imam Jafri Sadiq said, Become an ornament for us, not a disgrace. To show our loyalty, we should perform our prayers on time, give respect to teachers and parents, boys and girls do hijab properly, give respect to older people, ENN halal risk or any other good acts which we can perform to show loyalty to our Imam. We should remember in the first battle of Islam, the battle of Badr, only 313 true followers of Prophet Muhammad defeated the army of 1000 soldiers. Similarly, in the last battle of Islam, we should pray to Allah that we become one of the 313 companions of Imam al Mahdi.